I'm just a little tired, that's all. Well, you've been pushing yourself awfully hard recently. What with filming all these promos and interviews? And that's on top of all the power source research you've been doing. Speaking of which, you've been going to the lab pretty much every day, haven't you? Yeah, I have. Hmm. Here, I want you to have this. I like hands troning a music ticket. A movie ticket. Wait. Is this? It is a ticket to the premiere of Black Ark Ranger movie. Tomorrow is your first day off in ages. Why don't you go treat yourself to a movie? Why don't you go with her? I was planning on just taking a short break in the morning before going to the lab. No, no, you should take advantage of your time off and get some proper R&R. &R. But then you'll be here on your own. And? I'll get in a nice boom session while you're not here. Hehe. <laughs> Is that all you ever- Trony begrudgingly accepts the movie ticket. Huh? How come there are two? I knew you'd turn around halfway to the theater and make some excuse about it being crowded or something silly. So, please get the commander to tag along and make sure you actually turn up. Oh, we're getting turned? <laughs> okay, fine, I'll go. Oh, she's willing to go with me? You <laughs> have a good time then. Thank you for thinking of me. Oh, that sounded so sincere. Hold on, did you just say the commander is coming with me? <laughs> there you go. That's that's what I was expecting. Oh no, she's in shock. Slump. And like catches Trony as she limply falls from her chair. Hey, are you okay? Sorry, I just imagined asking the commander to see a movie together and got a bit lightheaded. <laughs> I mean, given the kind of person, or sorry, the kind of Nikkei that she is, uh, I would expect her to have that kind of social anxiety. Could you ask him for me by any chance? Okay, fine, I'll do it. Commander, Commander, Commander! Yes? Do you want to catch a movie tomorrow? I got two tickets to the Black Ark Ranger movie premiere. Sure. Great, but I got a question. What is it? Why are you using Troni's account, a leg? <gasps> uh, boom! Can't get past me. Huh? How did you? There are no messages for a while. Sorry, a leg snatched my f away my phone. Troni wanted me to help her ask if he wanted to catch a movie. I see. Trony sure doesn't waste time getting what she wants. Huh? You do realize this isn't a group chat, right? <laughs> oh, this is so... <laughs> oh my gosh. Did she leave again? Actually, you invited her back. <laughs> so, you're free tomorrow, Mr. Commander? Sure. Where do you want to meet? Trony. Uh, is the square okay? Okay. Happy face. Oh, happy face from Troni. That means a lot. Such honesty. I like it. <laughs> that was so good. Troni and I have agreed to meet at the square. And so I'm on my way there. <laughs> I wonder, is she in this like the entire time? So that means that are we going to the movie with her sitting in this? Once I arrive, I can see Trony sitting on the bench, staring blankly at the billboard. Okay, so she is actually not in this. Which is relaying a broadcast featuring the Electric Shock Squad. Morning. Hey, Commander. You're becoming quite a celebrity with all these TV appearances. Yeah. I hope nobody recognizes me. Just in case, though, I've been practicing my autograph. Hey, that's so, that's so adorable. I hope she has someone who actually wants an autograph. Trony and I watched the broadcast for a while. Hmm? For some reason, there doesn't appear to be any footage of Trony. And maybe a while yet until Trony is being harangued for autographs. How come they're only showing footage of a leg? Did she want to appear? I thought she was like, Oh, I hope it doesn't hurt her feelings. Uh, 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 didn't you want to go see the movie today? Why don't we head there to the theater? Oh, sure. 
Before we go, though, could you help me with something? What is it? Do you remember before when you asked me why I'd circled that date on the calendar? Uh, sure. That's the day I first joined the Electric Shock Squad. It was also the first time I ever met Elaine. Elaine has been doing so much for me all these years, and so I wanted to give her something for once. I was trying to think of what to get her as a present, but then I realized I've never actually given a gift to anyone before. Oh, Oh, she's... She, she's thoughtful. She's awkward but thoughtful. So I was hoping I could get some suggestions from you. I'd be happy to help. Do you have any general ideas of what to get her? Besides boom merchandise? A leg is all about boom, so I was thinking maybe something related to that. Oh. A boom guy plushie, maybe? Would that be weird? I think she'd love that. How about we head to the shopping center and check out the gaming store? The shopping center? Oh boy, let me take a few deep breaths. Uh oh. I mean, what what can we expect? Could could you give me a few days to prepare mentally? <laughs> uh, let's go. I dragged the reluctant Trony with me to the shopping center. Oh, okay. I just took her with me at the gaming store. Trony is cowering in a corner, hiding from all the other people. Trony, you'll never be able to choose a gift if you stay huddled in the corner. But Hello, is there something you're looking for? Ah! Oh, she's even more shocked. No, I remember it all. That traumatic interview, the panic being bombarded with questions, the humiliation of not being able to string words together and being sent to the orphanage. Oh, shit. Um, is everything all right, miss? Just pretend you didn't hear that. Did you- do you happen to have any boom-related products? Sorry, but Oleg recently cleaned us out, so we're all out of stock. Ah, I see. Thank you, anyway. Sure thing, if you need anything else, let me know. The store clerk leaves to help the other customers. What should we do now? Hmm... Oleg is an avid gamer, so how about we get her some gaming peripherals? I don't know... She's already got everything you could possibly need thanks to all the devices our squads have made. Right, I forgot you're both skilled inventors. <laughs> Is there something else a leg likes besides boom? I'm not sure. That's kind of pathetic when you think about it. <laughs> True. What do you mean? A leg understands me more than I understand myself. But I know next to nothing about her. Oh, okay. Hold on. What time is it? Oh my gosh, it's nearly time for the movie premiere! You're right. We'll figure out a gif after the movie. Alright. Time to drag me to the movie theater. Okay. Soon after, at the theater. Despite the fact that it's a grand premiere, there is a surprising lack of spectators. Even though I've seen all the episodes before, I'm still excited to see them in a new format. Shh. Sorry. Even though the movie hasn't started, Trony has both hands tightly clasped together and her eyes glued to the screen. Soon after, the movie begins. Dark Hero. As the title sequence flashes across the screen, Trony's eyes sparkle. After that, random snippets of fight scenes featuring the Black Ark Ranger illuminates the big screen. Long live the Ark Rangers! Next to me and Trony, there is another moviegoer who can't be clearly made out. I merely completed the mission, which was assigned to me. All the help I gave you tonight will only be known by you, me, and the dark sky above us. Woohoo! <laughs> Trony's actually cheering. Ah, oh, what a hero. Each time the Black Ranger utters a famous line, both Trony and the mysterious moviegoer have the same enthusiastic reaction. After a while, the movie reaches its conclusion. The Black Ark Ranger is so incredible. Ah, I feel good for her. Both Trony and the moviegoer adjacent to us were engrossed to the very end. Absolutely. What an incredible experience, Black Ark Ranger.
even as a credits run, they're still not fully over it. I knew it. I knew she was a hottie. This movie is always a blast to take in. The Black Ark Ranger? Oh, she opened her eyes. Sick. Dozer, Choni, it's been a while. Huh? She knows us? What? Black Ark Ranger? That's me. Did you enjoy the movie? How do you know our names? You both came to my fan meet and greet at the Ark Gaming Expo. Oh yeah! Hey, callback! Sick! Commander? Yeah? I can officially die and rest in peace now! <laughs> oh, you know what? I feel happy for her. That's a high I'm chasing throughout all my life. If you would, please pass my last will and testament revision number 430 onto a leg. Oh, she must be an absolute droop. <laughs> Look at her face. A dumbfounded Troni slumps on from her chair, and I manage to catch her before she hits the floor. You can't die yet. You still need to decide on a gift for a leg. All right. Troni, I heard you and a leg got the arc out of quite the pickle. Oh, that, that, was, that that's not nothing compared to what you do. All we did was repair a converter and restore the power. Nothing worth praising, really. If the Ark fell into darkness, the glimmer of hope amongst the citizens would likewise be snuffed out. You kept that hope alive. If that isn't worthy of being deemed a hero, then what is? I must express my heartfelt gratitude to you. I, I kept hope alive? No, I, I'm no hero, not like you. Everyone says I am, but I'm not an, a gallant figure they make me out to be. Tony averts her gaze as she ruthlessly puts herself down. You're not like me, you say. Tell me then, what kind of hero am I exactly? You saved people, and you've rescued the Ark from the brink of catastrophe countless times. Ha ha ha, is that so? Do you have a moment? Well, I do need to pick out a gift for a leg. It won't take much, too much of your time. I promise. We find ourselves walking around the Ark with the Black Ark Ranger performing various small acts of kindness, helping the elderly cross the street, playing with children. Oh, she's like just a hero. Thanks to these small displays of kindness, each area we visit is soon filled with laughter. That's enough for today, I think. We can end our patrol to here. Well done, you two. Do you usually patrol around like this? If I have time. The unfortunate thing is I typically don't have time to spare. You're pretty busy, so I can imagine. Too true. That's a, it's a pretty generic, but pretty sick design nonetheless. However, seeing everyone smile is the greatest reward I could ask for. It does make you feel good. Then let me ask you again, Choni. What kind of hero am I? Do I spend every waking moment saving people's lives and averting catastrophes? Or am I simply someone who, as we just saw, performs small acts of service? Tony, a hero is someone who fully embodies their beliefs, instead of living their life according to the ex expectations of others. Living by your own code and principles is what makes a true hero. You don't have to be exactly like me. You don't have to be this majestic figure that people envision you as. It's not important how other people see you. You need to define for yourself what justice means to you. You have to figure out for yourself what kind of hero you want to be and what, what principles you want to follow. What principles I want to follow. I know this all sounds very dramatic and lofty, but I'm just cribbing from a speech that Red gave me way back, which made me end up joining the Ark Rangers. Is this a squad? Are these like actors? Are these movies based on true stories? At the time, I thought I'd become a hero capable of empowering others like Red. Hehe, <laughs> I'm not used to talking this much. Anyways, I think I've made my point, so I'll say goodbye here. Oh, there is something I wanted to say. What's that? You're that kind of hero. You do empower others. Oh, never mind, I don't really know what I'm saying. Thank you. 
let's part ways here. Hopefully we'll have a chance to meet again in the future. With that, the Black Ark Ranger turns and leaves. Choni says goodbye for a long time as the figure of the Black Ark Ranger slowly fades into the distance. Oh, she's so happy. Oh, so happy. And something bad is about to happen to her. Suddenly I remember something. Choni about the gift. Huh? Even if it's not something you necessarily think a leg would want, as long as you put your heart into it, it'll be enough. It's the thought that counts. I see. I understand what you're saying. Sorry, but may I excuse myself? I've decided on what to get her. Of course! Let me know what she thinks of it. I will. Oh, and thank you for today. Damn. I wonder how it is for the commander to be able to juggle all these hangouts and dates with like all of these Nikkei. <laughs> As I watch Choni leave, the Black Ark Ranger's words echo in my mind. I think about that for a long time. Hmm, should I go back and give that movie another watch? <laughs>